Good morning. Today is a very important day in the lives of our fifth graders and their families. The Heritage staff would like to thank our families for the opportunity to work with your children. We will begin our promotion ceremony. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Each year, a PTO Scholarship Committee, this year led by Amy Andrich, evaluates multiple anonymous scholarship applications. At the end of the year, seniors are awarded a scholarship night, and they typically speak at our fifth grade promotion. The first scholarship is the Heritage General Scholarship and is awarded for involvement, service within the community, and at school. The second scholarship is the Heritage Has Heart Scholarship and that scholarship is given to a student who's living the ideals that we try to instill here at Heritage. The third scholarship is the West Florian Scholarship which is in honor of our first principal West Florian who was here for 16 years, the first 16 years of the building and that scholarship is awarded to a student who has an interest in going into the field of education. This year our three scholarship winners are Hannah Storm, Isabel Peters, and Regan Korsmeyer. Congratulations to our seniors for this high honor and good luck to them in their future. During this portion of our program, we would like to recognize our students who have received gold and silver presidential awards. To qualify for the gold presidential awards, students needed to score advanced on both ELA and math assessments from fourth grade and be in good academic standing during the fifth grade year. To receive a silver presidential award, students needed to received, receive at least accelerated on their math and ELA tests from fourth grade and be in good academic standing for their fifth grade year. Let's take a look at our presidential award winners this year. At Heritage, share your gift, make your mark, is really a saying developed from the eighth habit, find your voice. We study the eight habits, and these fifth graders have studied the eight habits the last six years, either in leaders in training or through leadership teams, and we are very proud of their efforts. Let's take a look at our eight habits award winners. <laughs>
At this time, I would like to call on Mr. Todorovich and Mr. Hartshorn to recognize our fifth grade students as they are promoted to sixth grade. Congratulations to our fifth grade students. This is the homeroom class for Mr. Todorovich, 2019-2020. Jake Barnes, Cannon Brown, London Chantapania, Zoe Felina, Jack Faust, Max Grossi, Nick Grunewald, Joe Hayes, Mason Hybert, Matthew Hetzler, Julie Heil, Bo Johnson, Ashley Cannonberg, Colin Martin, Michael Maddy, Nathan McBride Foote, Nevaeh McBride Foote, Marshall Owings, Ava Schellenberger, Tristan Savinsky, Zach Sohar, Caden Tanner, Ben Thompson, Michaela Traub, Aaron Tyson, Carter Vunderink, Jessica Wallach, and Colton Wilmoth. Best of luck to you, middle school. Congratulations. This is my 2019 2020 homeroom class. Logan Baker, Adrian Baranovic, Luke Barnes, Cooper Claypool, Jordan DeMell, Connor Eidenmiller, Brianna Fisher, Colin Gonzalez, Dylan Gray, Noah Graziosi, Tyler Grusendorf, Jason Hatem, Shiloh Harbin, Elizabeth Heal, Michael McCarty, Dylan Muchowski, Madison Roos, Alexandria Rose, Tessa Smith, Peyton Snow, Adrian Stockman, Gavin Stone, Jack Storm, Claire Thomas Mango, Sean Thompson, Liliana Uzinski, Brady Vane, and Mackenzie Ward. Congratulations to everyone. We're very, very proud of you. Good luck. Uh, we have a little going away poem that we wrote uh, for our fifth graders. Here it goes. To such wonderful students who will miss so much, please don't forget us and keep in touch. 2020 is a year we will never forget. We did a lot in fifth grade, even though it was cut short a bit. Close your eyes and think of a memory moment from this year. Don't worry, it's okay if you feel like shedding a tear. At Camp Christopher, we grew closer as a team and stayed up late. In reading, we, reached, we, we researched for weeks and had a huge debate. I hope you hold on to all the secret tips I gave you in math. Each of you are headed down such a bright path. In science, we learned about the planets and the sun. Whenever the D.A.R.E. officers came in, we had so much fun. I never thought we'd have to talk via Google Meet. Your elementary career is now complete. Each of you are special and have a place in our heart. A new chapter of your life is beginning to start. It seems crazy that your heritage career has come to an end. We are not just your teachers, but also your friends. Just want to say good luck to all of you, and you will all do great things. Love you guys. Going to miss you. Take care. To close our promotion ceremony today, I would like to say a special thank you to our parents. And I hope at the end of our promotion ceremony that our students 
also take a minute to thank their parents because as a parent myself, I understand the challenges of getting your children everything they need to be successful and supporting them when they're happy, when they're sad, when they're mad, or when they're challenged. So I appreciate all that you've done to share your wonderful, wonderful children with us. It's been a blessing to work with you and your children. So I'll conclude with a poem. I dreamt I stood in a studio and watched two sculptors there. The clay they used was a young child's mind and they fashioned it with care. One was a teacher, the tools she used were books, music, and art. The other a parent with guided hand and a loving heart. Day after day, the teacher taught with a touch that was deft and sure while the parent labored close nearby and polished it and smoothed it o'er. And when the teaching task was done, they were proud of what they had wrought, for the things they had molded into a child could never be sold or bought. And both agree they would have failed. If each had worked alone, for behind the parents stand the school and behind the school stands the home. So I wanna say congratulations one more time to our fifth grade students and I wanna thank, genuinely thank our parents for everything you've done for Heritage and for your children and I wish you all great success. That does conclude our fifth grade promotion. Have a wonderful day.